Hello and welcome back to Own Your Beauty. Today's video is going to be a quick review and it's of the Makeup Revolution Amazing Volume Mascara. And I've had this mascara for a wee while and I've already recently got round to using it. Now I've done a close up of me applying it so you can see how it applies. Um, it does add a wee bit of volume on the first application. Um, I do sort of apply a bit on first application and if I want just a feathery look I would go with maybe just one layer because it does sort of layer my lashes quite nicely. It is a wee bit thick of itself, but um, that's not too much of a problem if you comb through your lashes. There's not too much clumping, but there is a wee bit, but not too much. Um, on second application, I get loads of volume. I'm really impressed. So two layers of this in my top lashes. I wait till it's dried a wee bit before I apply the second layer, and that layers up really nicely. There's loads of volume sort of from the root all the way out to the tip. I really do have to go over the tips a wee bit. Again, it is a wee bit clumpy so you have to just take your time wiggling it through and getting through to the ends. It doesn't seem to weigh my lashes down particularly so I still, my lashes still have a curl. You know, I don't lose my curl because of the mascara. Um, it does wear pretty well throughout the day. Um, I think if I apply too much, sometimes I get a wee bit of fall down. I normally wouldn't apply it to my lower, my lower lashes, you know, if just a normal day, because it does fall down a wee bit and I do get a bit of grey underneath my uh, lower lash line. It's, yeah, it's, it's a decent mascara. It's only two pounds, so that's a bit of a winner. Um, it's quite a dry formula to start with and it is quite thick. I sort of always take the mascara off the end there and off the tip as well just to make sure there's not too much mascara when I apply it. You can see there it's quite thick of itself. So I could see that this would probably dry out pretty quickly, but for two pounds, you know, I'm not gonna complain too much. Um, yeah, I'm quite impressed with this. I'm annoyed I haven't tried it sooner because I actually do quite enjoy using it. I use it mostly on my tap lashes only. Um, I do have to find a good mascara for the lower one. I did attempt to purchase the Clinique bottom lash, but it somehow fell out of my basket and I never purchased it. So yes, I will try that next, but yeah, I would recommend checking this out. Cheap and cheerful, does a really good job, lasts pretty well. Just be careful you don't apply too much and always sort of clean off your brush before you apply any. Um, yeah, recommend checking it out. There are before and after pictures over on the blog, so I will link that down below as always. And on my social media, of everything is down below as well in the description box. But yes, if you have any questions, um, just leave it in the comments and I'll reply. And that's it, so thank you very, very much for watching. Please like if you like, please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video.